What's going on guys, Arkane here, back with Dribble the Breakers video. In today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at Fat Boo. So if you guys don't know, the three uh, you know, original raiders of the game were like the first three like summonable transfers that we got in the game as well. One of them being Fat Boo. Now he was never really that great. I think the uh the better transfers were definitely Cell and Frieza. Uh probably Honestly, it's actually up for debate whether Cell is better than Frieza, but I guess, you know, we'll figure that out in these uh, revisiting here. So I'm kind of like tackling these a little bit different as opposed to like a standard showcase. I'm going to like, I guess, showcase at the beginning and show you guys the damage and the key blast at the beginning of the match. Just because I don't like, I, I feel like I want this to be more like a fun revisit. It's kind of light. I'm not like super stressed and like try harding to like land supers and like, you know, make the transfers look good. If, they're, if we if we do bad, we do bad. If we do good, we do good. I was trying to do that with like, I freeze one a little bit, and then I'm just like, let's just have fun with it, bro. So we're going to hop into practice and just see how Innocence Cannon is and the Key Blast on Boo overall. See the damage, see the speed of the Key Blast, all that good stuff. And um, just uh, kind of get a good read of how good uh, Boo is. All right, so this is uh, level one Boo. It's funny, we got like skinny, like in shape Boo, not a fat Boo. But when you're level four, you turn to fat Boo. So for the level one Key Blast, he yeah, actually has one of the most interesting Key Blasts in the game. Uh, it's like a shotgun spread. For some reason, they they gave Boo, uh, like Ginyu's Key Blast, which is very interesting. I actually wonder if they used like this type of Key Blast to like make Ginyu's at his level four. And as you can see, the damage is actually like not that bad. It's like you can just spam these. It's, uh, it's it's interesting. Like there's no other Key Blast like in like like this in the game. I don't know how good this is for countering Key Blast. Uh, we can't really test it here since uh, we got a Spellovich, but it, it's you know it's something. Uh, let me just get him to a full bar here, or four ball, full bar-ish. All right, well, that's ish, I guess. So this is Innocence Cannon. Uh, as you can see, it's not a full bar. Actually, do we have Train by an Angel on? I think we might, so we might be, might not be seeing the full damage on that. But uh, yeah, this is it from a full bar. Actually, I think that is the damage. I don't know. Well, this is level one, to be fair. Yeah, that's a super attack. Um, it's okay. It's all right. But uh, I think the, the best thing about level 1 Boo is probably the Key Blast. I like them. I actually do like them. Some level 1s uh, in the early days actually had decent Key Blast. So this is Key Blast at level 2. Uh, this is pretty spammy, man. I don't know how this, good this actually is. But I don't know. It, the damage is actually not bad. What? It's not bad damage. Am I crazy? That's like... I'm just curious how much does like a full bar. Two... Three... Four... Five... So about six. There's a full... That's actually not bad. I mean, again... It, like, that's why like I don't like showcasing things in practice. Because things can appear to be really good. Uh, but, you know, in a real game, that might not be that. Oh, it's, it's still Innocence Cannon. At uh, level three. Right, so we'll see the damage of Innocence Cannon. Okay, so it's almost a full bar. Almost a full bar. Yeah, so it's about three quarters. It's about three quarters. All right, so we'll go ahead and hop into um, a real game here. Just see what we can do with Boo. But uh, honestly, I you know... Oh, yes. Oh, I was still... I was still level two. Oops. All right, so he has uh, Kamehaza as level three. So we didn't, get, we didn't actually get to see the damage. Of um, level 3 super there. So I imagine it's a little bit more. A little bit more. But um, I'll just show it to you. We'll be right back. Alright, so I actually... Uh, I forgot I trained by an angel on. So this is like the damage with the key blast. Didn't want to do that. Okay, but it's basically the same damage as the key blast do. You land uh, 4 of these. That's going to be a full bar. And then uh, the damage as a level 1 with uh, this. Is actually not bad on Spolovich, but uh, Spolovich, I don't believe, has standard health, but just so you guys get to see that. Alright, so Fat Boo does have standard health, so we're uh, Boo on Boo violence right now. So this is the Kamehameha damage. Um, I actually, I think I like the Innocence Cannons more. But yeah, this is uh, the full damage. Actually, it goes through the Raider, that's pretty interesting. Actually, I think they all do. Never mind, what am I talking about? So this is the, the damage. The max amount of damage you'll do to a standard uh, health bar raider. So it's uh, pretty much a bar in like three quarters. Or it's three quarters of a bar is what I meant to say. So standard damage, nothing crazy. So we'll go ahead and hop in the match and see how we do. 
All right, for our first match, we're going up against a Vegeta Raider here. Um, they're not 176. It is actually hilarious. They have yet to fix this bug. Uh, like this bug where it shows your survivor level as opposed to your Raider level. But um, I am a dummy, and I forgot to put Train by an Angel back on for this match. So we will be uh, moving at standard flight speed after we uh, lose resistance. So, Damn, Par. Bro's been in the gym. I see you, dude. Took out those plates like it was nothing, bro. Okay. Also realize I have aftermath equipped. Yo, I am just like I have aftermath equipped from uh the freezer show just to take it off, bro. I guess aftermath isn't even that bad though, to be fair. I mean I had a stun on before. I wonder if uh after image with the innocence cannon works. You can see it, dude. Alright. This is the Chad baby, bro. Vegeta. Sabin only needs one um, survivor to evolve. Baby needs, what, five? Or two? Somebody needs to make that meme, bro. It's like uh, the Chad Vegeta versus, like, the Beta baby. Somebody please do that. Thank you. Alright. Damn, that's what I'm talking about, bro. Like, that was so... Like, you're not seeing babies evolve in a minute. Not, not regularly, anyway. So I got a key radar, dragon radar. We gotta predict that radar now. Okay. Hey, just a random ball on a icicle. Oh come on! Okay, I might just grab this ball and run. Pause. Nice. All right. I was gonna... Could have maybe tried to get the soda in there as well. I need help. Okay. Okay. Got our level two. Very nice. Very nice. Cool. Also, let me know in the comments, guys, just because as I'm doing the re these revisitings, like I'm pretty open to like what you guys want to see for them. Uh, if there's any transfers you want me to redo, I was thinking honestly to like revisit all of the transfers from like season one and even some from season two, just because I think what I originally showcased the first transfer from season two. I think I actually did Super Saiyan Goku and Gohan together. Uh, so I never did them separate. If you guys would like to see that separate, I totally could. I think we technically have done Goku. Like, we checked out Warp Kamehameha. Huh? But uh, I don't know if we necessarily did, like, a transfer, like, dedicated video on just him exclusively. So let's start working on this key. We get at least the or C set. We'll be in a pretty good spot. We got four balls. All right. It's crazy, man. Vegeta has gotten so good. Like, people talk about how Baby can snowball, but it genuine, genuinely feels like if... Uh... Damn. I might just hightail it. Just, I want to risk getting down. But, you know, it feels like if Vegeta comes out before the STM does, like, you're probably losing that game. It... Oh. Do I fight him here? Maybe I do. Then I wall one out immediately. All right, shoot out a little key blast, innocence cannon. Innocence cannon. That didn't hit him? Wow. It's actually crazy that didn't hit. That hit. Alright, well, that's all I got. See you, fellas. Good luck. Oh, we kill him there. That's actually massive. Come on, boys. I believe. I believe. I, I, be I believe. I think he. Li yeah, he lived. To be fair, Nappa does have crazy melees at Krill's range, but that's kind of stinky. Well, we tried them. We tried, bro. I think he might just evolve by uh, his damage passive. Yeah, there it is. 
That stinks. If we would have killed Nappa there, we actually would have had a shot. I think we just lose this game now, though, unfortunately. And if we do get all the rest of the balls. I mean, we would just have to kill him. And unfortunately, I'm not running souls or anything like that. Not even going for it, bro. I say the Xeno. Gotta get the hell out of here. How far we got on this? Not far at all. <laughs> Alright, I should regroup with the other boys, get the balls, and then plant the STM. Do we just plant the key? Trying to figure out how to escape. So who wants to die next? This is tough. Because I wanna I wanna save my D change for um summoning. So if I summon or if I D change early and I summon like this possibility could take us out. Alright, so B oh we took out B. Mm, B is like one of the best places to summon. Here is a little bit better, but yeah, we gotta plant this key if we wanna have a shot. Hopefully one of the other guys can do it. We do have to go for it though, because he's just his eight timer is just gonna keep clicking or ticking. And heal at least. Alright, well. If somebody transforms and fights him, I can distract with the summon. <laughs> what a bunch of wimps. Yeah, I'm not sure what the team's doing right now. Okay. All right, guys, you need to commit to the plant. Otherwise, he's just going to come to me. <laughs> All right, it worked out, I guess. Come on, All right, we're gonna be Fat Boo. I haven't been Fat Boo in actually ages. Awesome, guys, thanks. All right, well, at least we got the SDM planted. Sorry, sorry, I'm, I'm not gonna complain about my teammates anymore, I'm sorry. Leave that little guy alone, Vegeta. Yeah. Jesus. Okay. All right. All right, bro. All right. Okay. If he gets... Honestly, if he gets ape, he's taking a good bit of damage. If I stay healthy, it might not be the end of the world. Does he know? Damn. Train by Angel would be so nice right now. Dude, you, you would think with how fat Innocence Cannon is. Okay, we hit him there. Yeah, it has no AoE on the explosion. Damn, his combat house are kind of thin. Shoot, I, I thought I had grapple. I do not. Just trying to do what I can, bruh. There's Ape, okay. If we had dodged, I'd be a little bit more uh, confident here, but I can literally only dodge one of his mouth beams, and that's it. We want to get in a situation where we force him to play STM. Oh, he's just coming to me, yeah. Yeah, I 
This is all I got, bro. If the SDM was further along, like, we might have been able to do something. But... It's tough. And have that many resources to escape. It's good damage, though. And the thing is, like, ideally we would want to force him to play STM, but it's not, it's not, like, close enough to starting to warn him to even bother working on it. Oh, I forgot it's the tail. It's not baby. Surely that hits the tail from here, right? What? Bro, how is that missing? <laughs> Come on, man. There's no way that's missing with how fat that is. Well, there it is, dude. We tried. Yeah, the only way we would have won that one is if we had the STM further along. But uh, unfortunately, we did not. I mean, we lost, you know, we lost a lot of players, too. But uh, we did a decent amount of damage there. It was just, uh, the STM was not far along enough to, like, force him to play STM while I was level 4. So, he was kind of able just to focus me down. But, uh, I don't, I don't think that's, like, I mean, I do think those Innocence Cannons should have hit his tail. Genuinely. But, I don't, I don't really think we lost this game because of Boo, personally. I just, you know, we lost of circumstance. Alrighty, first, second match, we're gonna go up against another Vegeta. Uh, same map. So, uh, we'll see if we, uh, get to get our run back here. Uh, turns over survivor levels. We have a 350. Sheesh. 350. Golly, bro. Uh, I mean, at this point, we're about, like, what? A month and some change into the season. But, like, 350 is kind of wild, bro. I mean, I guess if you take advantage of the uh, the double XP at the start of the season and you just play survivor, I think it's possible. But, like, that is some dedication to the grind, bro. That is some dedication. We, we still got until October, bro. <laughs> Golly. Already. So uh, I opted to put on an uh, angry shout. It's because, like, I guess we're showcasing or revisiting Boo. I'm just in the habit of saying showcasing, but it is kind of nice just taking that pressure off my shoulders of, like, I don't know, like, I have to make this transfer look good. I have to, like, get good. I don't know. It's kind of just nice just hopping on and just playing for fun and just, like, using a transfer I don't use. So I hope you guys, like, what's up, dude? Thanks, Bingus. Oh. Damn, that was a quick one, bro. Oh, did he get quick sieves? He must have got the god spawn, bro. Yeah, this map, if you uh if you spawn in like, I think D, there's like a god spawn where you can get like four quick sieves back to back to back, and I think he got it because he even down anybody there. So we got our level one here. We got another DC. Did we get a DC last game? Am I crazy? I don't know. I mean, I guess it would be a session on breakers and one of these one DC. Got two balls. And bangs, thank you for the fall. Dude, was that fart extra loud for anybody else? I'll never forget, like, when I first made that my follower uh, notification on Twitch. It used to make me laugh every time. Like, <laughs> I don't know if, the, if that's, like, still up for people to see. But I remember laughing every single time the little kale fart happened, bro. I still don't know what that animation is supposed to be, man. I still don't know what that animation is supposed to be. Alright. Yeah, I, I... This game is looking like a wash, dude. This game is looking like an extra wash. Machine wash cold, dude. Separating the, the whites and the... And the... I'm a, I don't think I will finish that sentence. Um, all right, dude. We'll get some extra charge power there. Oh, boy. <laughs> I got to stop talking sometimes, man. I just got to, like, think about the words that are about to come out of my mouth and just, like, take a deep breath and just, like, think about what's being said. That's all. 
Anyways, dude, Dragon Ball the Breakers, guys. What a game, dude. What a season. Wow. All right. Um. Wow. This is quite the pooey match. This one is awful, brother. This one is an awful game. I don't know if the Raider is camping or tunneling or what, but we're not looking too good here, dude. We are not looking too good at all. All right, at least we're playing the C key, so you won't land in a uh, C and D situation. I don't know if Breakers done four wants to play four of uh, the Dragon Balls here. We could play Rock Paper Scissors, or he just walk by me. Damn, bro. Literally me when I like come home and show my parents my report card and they just ignore me. It's tough. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. It's literally never happened, bro. <laughs> Thanks, Mingus. Uh, maybe I should start putting an instant transmission, dude. Because people are just dying. Like, there's nothing I can do. I can't get to that guy in time. Alright, so we still need A and B. This sucks, dude. I feel like we're kind of just, like, delaying the inevitable. Like, it's like that's what it feels like with Vegeta, man. He's the only writer that feels like that. Like, we would have to do a, an insane wombo combo to kill Nappa to, like, have a chance. That's a new power key. Place it now. Got the B key. I guess I'll look for the A key. I feel like the A key is so hard to find. Hey, great. You oh, found there it is. Use it quick. See if I can start working on it before he does area destruction. If we get it to past half, I can actually plan it. I mean, if I were him, I would just area destruct and just camp the other area. But um, if we can get a 15%, at least we'll be a little bit better. Is that a 350 player getting down? Now, listen, I know I said I want to complain about teammates, but I just, listen, I, I, I wanted to get carried, bro. Oh, he's destroying B. Dang. If I was closer, I probably could have, like, hopped in the area and, like, maybe get a quick, uh, plant. Yeah, we were pretty cooked, bro. Even if we get this level 4, it probably will not matter. Um, I can't even res this guy. Yeah, but all my stuff is on cooldown, unless somebody else can get to him. Hey, JFGG, thank you for the follow, brother. It's about BGGs for me, man, I'll tell you that much. Alright, let's, let's land these Innocence Cannon Key Blasts, bro. Let's help Bingus out. Innocence Cannon! Innocence Can- Alright. Innocence Cannon! How did all of those miss, man? I the damage on that isn't even that bad, but it's just so hard to hit. What's up, dude? Ooh! Stop shooting me, dude. Stop- Alright. I said stop! <laughs> but why, bro? Why, why, why haven't finished me off, man? Maybe, you know? Alright, well. Let's get, see, if this was like a showcase, I would not leave this in, bro. But this is the genuine Breaker's experience. In a nutshell. Uh, yeah, I mean, this game is like wrapped up. We'll show. Uh, I think Babs here is going for the res, but... He's 100% getting ape. Oh, maybe because I had the balls. That's why he wanted to get me. That's fair. Hey. Good old uh, support build. Pretty based. Alright, hope well, we can grab these supplies really quick. I mean... It's really just kind of delaying the inevitable at this point, but maybe I should try working on STM. Our only hope is STM at this point, because we can't kill. We would have to get this to like 75 to have a chance to like stall for his ape. 
Haha, you can't hit me. Alright, well, you can hit me now, dude. Haha! You can't, I'm too fast! Call me ha! I stole that move, dude. Nope. That's my one dodge for every six seconds, dude. I, I'm gonna I mean, I'm use it wisely. We're actually stalling for a pretty long time here. Bro, once my cojones. is. Nope. What? The other vanish kick hit me, I guess. Oh man. I just I got nowhere to go, bro. <laughs> Stop! Stop! Leave me alone! Alright. <laughs> hey! Hey, we stalled for a long ass time! We stalled for a long ass time though. If uh, he didn't catch my ship with the the vanish kick, we actually could have like stalled even longer. Oh, no. This guy 100% has ape though. We'll just see what happens. Oof. All right, he went ape. Honestly, Babs could force them into situ- I don't know if Babs has a stun, but they could force the Vegeta in a situation where, like, they have to play STM. And if that's the case, like, there is a chance. Honestly, they should have saved their grapple, because now he they can just play STM. Or is he just going for the kill? I don't know if this guy has any skills. Oof. Damn, bro. If I, like, if I distracted a little bit longer... Because this guy was kind of trolling playing like that. He was really confident in getting those kills, but... We actually had a shot there. Yeah, if my ship didn't get hit... The, uh, the range on Vegeta's Vanish Kicks are, like, still crazy to this day. But, uh, we tried, bro. We tried. I guess we'll, uh, do one more match to see what we can do. All right, for our final match, uh, we're going against a level 350 baby. I think this is literally the survivor that was in our last match. Um, uh, and I got a hat now, guys. I got a hat. What's up? I'm, I'm Virgil King. If you guys know who Virgil is, I'm, I'm cosplaying Virgil. So here we are. Here we are, dude. Got to stare at the floor the whole time. <laughs> I start with Virgil times. Well, you can see, like, the reflection of, like, the game <laughs> in my glasses. Like, these are blue light glasses, and I actually, like, never wear them, bro. Alright. Here's where the, the baby boy is. Can I see him with the scouter? Oh! There he is! He's on the run! There he goes, guys! I can see him! Oh my god! It's terrif- Oh, Jesus. Alright, damn, that was fast. Dude, maybe you really just gotta be unpredictable baby, dude. Maybe maybe it really is just a skill issue, guys. Or maybe you just gotta stream snipe a streamer. Sorry. I'm just saying that because he was in my very last game, so I'm just assuming, but, you know, it could be chance. You don't know, dude. Maybe maybe he was just playing at the same time as I was, as, a, you know, as they always say. Oh, man. All right. You wonder what's crazy? This guy is a... He is a, he is a gamer, bro. He... He's... Level 350 as Survivor and has Baby also maxed out. I just want you guys to like... You know let let that sink in your house. Just just let that sink in your house really quick. He has nowhere else to set, stay. Just let that sink in, bro. Let that sink in. Um...
Not looking too hot this game. I'm not going to hold you. Indubitably. Not looking too good. Sorry, I keep my, I'm not really that good at accents, bro. I tried, man. I can do a Trump kind of. I have to. I have to like hear it. I have to hear it. What help, What helps me with my Trump? I like. I gotta hear like Zach Hadel do his Trump. Um, he he does a really good one. But um, I can't. I can't just like do a roll. I feel like I'm talking about so much. I gotta try now. Okay, I gotta figure like what he would say, dude. I, I, I gotta, like, think about what he would say. I got nothing, bro. I'm blanking out. I'm blanking out. I Normally, my, my go-to is, like, Dragon Ball the Breakers. <laughs> Season 6. What a disappointment. Something like that. Need some work. Oh. Affected says. Definitely need some work. There we go. Right, bro almost has his level 3. Got a cooldown drink. Why do I still have a... freaking scouter, bro. Okay, so he's got his level 3. Someone in chat just put in a Donald Trump quote. I, I, I don't know, bro. I, like, I gotta hear someone else do it. I gotta, like... Hear someone else do an impression. I can't just, like, do one on the spot. I will say I do think uh, Golden Baby is pretty pretty epic. Does look I. Right. One thing I I will give Baby is that I think all of his skins look pretty good. Doesn't really have a skin I dislike. I want to use the the panic run to move around a little bit faster. All right, so we got C and D left. Imagine if he's sending the C. Yeah. Right, so let me head over to D. All right. So the silver lining is that we will get supplies, guys, since he's level three. Uh we have five balls, but I think this guy might get caught. Oh, we have six in total, actually. Yeah, he's really hounding that boy. I can grab this soda here. Fuck, bro! What the hell, man? I should have looked up, and now I'm just dead. God damn it. Not worth. Not worth. This guy's a fiend machine. I'm just dead as hell. Oh, actually, never mind. That almost worked. I needed to look up. If I looked up, uh, my character would have prioritized the balls. I could have got them back. So that's my goof there. Yeah, that's one thing that's good about Angry Shout is you can like instantly knock back the raider. This is probably an affected Civ, honestly. Right, so we got our level two at the very least. I don't know where the rest of the bulls are at. This guy's four. Ally down. If you intend to rescue them, watch out for it. Oh, she did a sauce of some supplies, my friend. Get a barrier too. What is, uh, what is Mr. Baps doing to his balls? Alright. Trunks, you gonna drop these supplies today, champ? Alright, I guess I'll just try doing a hit and run. I missed. Okay. I can do this, I guess. Oh, that hit, bro! Let's go! I have nothing. My change is about to end.
Uh, probably just destroys this here, honestly. Well, if he gets this guy down, it's game over. Yeah, he's going to get that because he already put his eggs in him. We can't really stop that. That's GG's. And Bulma's simp ass is going to give him the G-spot raise. Yeah, if I got those... I mean, to be fair, I don't think we have uh, five balls on us anyway. Holy hell. You just transformed to be on the safe side. Yeah, we still have four, so it's not like it would have mattered if I did get him, but I could have got him. I could try resin you, friend, but... Just trying to be friendly, bro! Oh, man. You wouldn't shoot me from all that way, would you? Well, uh, this game's a wash, boys. Um, I hope you enjoyed this revisiting of Boo. Kind of fun. Just check it out, Boo. Um, Innocence Cannon is not great. I do think his uh, Key Blasts are kind of interesting. But, uh, you know, he's he's not that great. But, to be fair, I don't think, you know, it was... What the hell canceled my Instant Rise there? Was it just his big monkey ass? All right. All right, so, uh, <laughs> this guy. <laughs> he gets this res off, bro. All right. This gold 350 <laughs> survivor, he did it, man. He did it. I right, know, that's going to be the vid. I just kind of wanted to uh, revisit Boo, check him out, see how he is, because I never really, like, did, like, a video uh, on him, dedicated what. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Uh, comment down below your thoughts. And subscribe to uh, the Iron King for more videos like these. And I'll catch y'all in the next one, dude. Take care. Stay safe. Have fun. Peace out. Peace out.